always, now and never, or every and ever. Hello, my name is Victoria Rose. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing something incredibly exciting and I didn't even think that I'd be able to do this, but I'm gonna fly an airplane. The first thing that we've done is tried out the flight simulator, um, which kind of gives the very, very basics of how you fly. If you, how do you restart it if you want to? Uh, um, I will suspect escape. Them. I, so I'm doing the simulator right now, and it's actually um, a lot different than I thought it was gonna be. So remember that black lever, run it up to the top, that's good. We're raising the nose, holding that altitude down. Okay, good. There we go, just pitch it back. Pitch, pitch me. Pitch is kind of where the nose is relative to the horizon, okay? That's good. And then pulling that power back. Hey, all the way to the back. Yep, perfect. So hold that nose up initially. You want the speed to drop off. That's good. And then start to lower that nose down to jump it up. I know. <laughs> and now I'm going to get a briefing from Philip. I want to say your name right. And she's going to uh, debrief me on airplane things. I've never flown before. I've never even come close to flying. I've flown my drone, as you guys have seen. But other than that, we're in London right now. Um, I'm at the Flight Training London. I'll put the link below if you guys want to do this because you can actually learn to fly. Like right outside of London, you can basically take the train to get out here and then Uber. So that's what I did, and now we're here, and let's get debriefed. All right, debrief me. Yoke, rudder pedals. Okay. Yoke, rudder so pedals. That controls the ailerons, which run away. You've got your elevator on the sail, again, forwards and backwards, and that causes that yawing motion. Okay. So we've got roll, pitch, and yaw. So pulling yaw. backwards on the yoke, nose pitches up, we get a slower airspeed. Like how many classes, or like what do you have to do? It really depends on the student. So if you've got someone who comes in uh, and they can fly every day a week, weather permitting, you can get it done in a couple of months. A couple of months. Um, you need 45 hours total. Okay. Uh, so many of those have to be in a, with an instructor, so many have to be solo if you're going for a private pilot's license. Um, you have to do a qualifying cross country as well. So that's a solo flight where you go 150 nautical miles, landing away at two different airfields. Tell me the percentage um, male, female in this field. Uh, so, studies vary, but it tends to be between 3 to 5%. Yeah, percent. it's tiny. Um, we're doing our best to improve it, and we are seeing more girls coming through, but it's still majoritively male-dominated at the moment. For the commercial license, you need to hold a commercial to charge money. Okay. Uh, however, you can do cost-sharing if you're a PPL holder, oh. in which case everyone in the aircraft would have to contribute at least so the same amount really of money. you can't really make money unless you're No, you can't make money because um, commercial is held to a higher standard. Okay. So uh, we operate our trial lessons as, it's a flight with an instructor, it's finding out if you want to pursue a license. Yeah. So here we are. Great, we're in here, this little plane. It's a lot of things. I did not bring the right shoes. It'll stay. I just want to make oh, sure right. it's getting both of us and everything in here. We'll find out. Testing. How can we? Oh, I'm back on again. So just put this back here. Yeah, yeah, just throw the back. It's looking good. So we're 300 feet above the ground. I'm sick. 300 feet. Then. Well, 300 feet above sea level. Okay. Okay. <laughs> there we go. So many knobs and levers. <laughs> Right? <laughs> it's really cool.
are landed and that was flying a plane. It was really, it's really cold right now, but I'll update you inside. So I wanted to finish off this video with my final thoughts on flying. Um, I, I, and I loved it. I loved it more than I even thought I would, which I knew that I would love it a lot. And my new plan is to actually become a pilot. Like I really want to do that. It's going to take 44 more hours. I got 45 in. I have my certificate of one hour of flying down. And the thing about flying is that it's very expensive, which is not why more people don't do it, but like 3% of them are female. I want to be a female pilot. I'm going to do it. I just need to set aside a few months, have a ton of money and become a pilot with that type of pilot's license. I mean, you can't even make money, but I don't care. I'm going to have a monkey and I'm going to be a pilot. Everyone always wonders my goals. Well, there's some of them. It's important for me to get new perspectives of the earth, of life, of through my eyeballs, physically seeing things differently because I get so much in my head that it's very hard to recognize different perspectives and life is all about perspective. Life is what is going on in the inner world. So I try to, the bigger picture, I have a problem with the bigger picture. So flying really did that for me, literally. Like I could just see the world down below and nothing really seems that wrong when you're up there. <laughs> so that's why I like flying. Let me know in the comments if you guys, if you prefer like flying or if you prefer like ocean diving, there's, or if you prefer staying right on the land. <laughs> Thank you for joining me in this video. I wouldn't be able to do this stuff without you. Stay extraterrestrial. Yes, I'd rather fly a spaceship, but I need to build one after I get my pilot's license. <laughs> Bye. Believe me, darling, the stars were made for four.